Right, so, uh, we resume after the alchemy session, and obviously I'm doing a bit more making some useful potions, but also discovering new properties for some of the, the new uh, ingredients. Not all of them though, because I only do so much in a go. So, quit alchemy. That'll do for now, I think. I almost forgot what I was doing. Right, so. So, focus. Let's check the map. Which way are we going? Right, so. Interesting. I need to get up here, I suppose. Can't go through that way. Well, you can't go up that way. Oh, come on. This is this is a a big a big um that's better <laughs> okay it's a big giant frostbite spider there does anyone have enough magic in there oh I got two potions of venom out of that one. Uh oh. It's like the skeever went off and got its friends. So you're gonna bully me, are you? Because I'm small. And it goes off, comes back with its two big mates. See, that's the problem. Sorry, mate.
Yeah, I've gone down onto far more arrows now. So I ran out of dwarven arrows. I mean, I picked up one up off the corpse since then, but I don't have enough of them to use them, so I'm down onto farm arrows. Oops, I didn't mean to pick up that steel mace. Third wall. Fire. Fire breath. Fragment of Wuth Rod. Well, let's take the potions and the soul gems and the fragment of Wuth Rod. Okay. Now let's have a look in this chest. Plenty of gold. Spell time for fury. Like most things won't be even affected by fury. Amulet of Kinnereth, which increases your stamina. And a jade and emerald cir circlet. Okay, I thought as much. <laughs> yeah. That's Dawn Breaker at its best. Oops, a daisy. Oh, they're all coming out. Oops, a daisy. Oh! Oh, God, Bennett! How many did he set off at once? Sort myself out here. <sighs> I 
It's just like setting off all the all the bad guys here. <laughs> Every single one. It's like there's a there's a clown car that they're all just coming out of. I'm not trying to attack you, Farkas, I'm trying to attack it. Where's Farkas gone? Where's he gone? There he is. It's like he just suddenly disappeared. This was a very handy sword to have for this fight because it's good against large groups of undead and that's what was happening there it was a large group of undead so very handy any more for any more? what's up here? Oh, oh, aye, aye. I see. Oh, we need to level up. Let's just sort that out now. Alright, so we levelled up. And what shall we improve? Our magicka, our health, our stamina. Magicka. We still can't even cast that lightning rune spell. quite a bit of archery and I'm starting to feel a bit uh, underpowered compared to like where I want to be with doing damage with it so I can't take the next rank of critical shot yet I can take Hunter's Discipline which means recover twice as many arrows from dead bodies I do like that one Now, let's get this fragment back to you, Vasker.
bear. No, it's not a bear. It's it's a mammoth. Mammoths aren't as aggressive as bears. We just give it a wide berth. I'm sure we'll be fine. Giant camp. Mud crop. Don't worry about the mud crops. Firstly, they're aggressive, and secondly, you can harvest ingredients from them. Back to White Run we go. I wonder if we can fast travel. Or whether we can't if Farkas is travelling. Oi oi. Why is he drawing his weapons? Oh, because I've got mine out, that's why. If I put my hands away like that, he'll put his sword away. There's really nothing to bother us on the way, so. Uh, can we just fast travel? Yes, we can. Being safe, I hope. Yes. Wait, what? I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's hmm. see here. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstar. The owner is asking me to hand out invitations to travelers. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Visit the museum in Dawnstar. Okay. Interesting. Need a blade? You should talk to Adrian at the forge. Oh, it's just someone chopping wood. Ah, yes, now it's daytime. I can have another go at buying the house and uh, sell my stuff in the shop. But before I do that, I need to get Feindal back because Feindal's got most of the stuff I want to sell. Well, at least I can buy the house. That that's important. Buying the house. Where is everyone? There they are. Brothers and sisters of the circle, today we welcome a new soul to our mortal fold. This man has endured, has challenged, and has shown his valor. Who will speak for him? I stand witness to the courage of the soul before us. Would you raise your shield in his defense? I would stand at his back, that the world might never overtake us. And would you raise your sword in his honor? It stands ready to meet the blood of his foes. And would you raise a mug in his name? I would lead the song of triumph as our mead hall reveled in his stories. Then the judgment of this circle is complete. His heart beats with fury and courage that united the companions since the days of the distant green summers. Let it beat with ours that the mountains may echo and our enemies may tremble at the call. It shall, it shall be so. so. Hey, I think I've probably well, joined boy, the companions. One of us now. I trust you won't disappoint. There we go. Talk to the companion.
companion's leader's full work. I can also now ask him, is it true that the companions are werewolves? Like most of our band, uh, I found this family after losing my own. I tried to select tried that and it selected the wrong thing. Land, learning all I could of the sword and the axe. I was just a boy, but I had the fire of a man in my heart. Eventually, my body caught up to my spirit. My predecessor, Asgar, found me in Hammerfell. I was serving as a bodyguard for some weak-necked lord out there. He brought me back here, and I realized that I was actually coming home. I worked to bring honor to this family, and to the family that I lost. For my mother, my father, and my grandfather. For all my S.H.I.E.L.D. siblings. Family and honor. That's what it means to be one of us, boy. Uh-huh. I mean, he calls me boy. As a Bosmer, I mean, I might well be hundreds of years older than he is, but we'll assume that I'm not. Uh, right. Is it true that the Companions are werewolves? I see you've been allowed to know some secrets before your appointed time. No matter. Yes, it's true. Not every Companion, though. Only members of the Circle all share the blood of the Beast. Some take to it more than others. What about well, I grow old. My mind turns towards the horizon, to Sovngarde. I worry that Shore won't call an animal to glory as he would a true Nord warrior. Living as beasts draws our souls closer to the Daedric Lord Hircin. Some may prefer an eternity in his hunting grounds, but I crave the fellowship of Sovngarde. You're looking to cure yourself? Yes, but it's no easy matter. But you don't need to share the worries of an old warrior. This day is to rejoice in your bravery. And speak to Yorland if you want a better weapon than whatever that is. <laughs> the latest recruit, right? Wait, yeah. is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah it totally is. Hey. And look! It's not stealing anymore! I can take the chase and all the other stuff. I take the chase. Right. Um. See? You still need to prove oh. yourself, Will. No, no, I don't. I've proved myself and I can have the chase. Right. When the Empire on the old Larry Dominion. I know our history almost as well as Vignar by now. Except I can remember it. <laughs> right, I'm supposed to speak to people for, for jobs. Think now, Grey Man. We Grey Maids have been feuding with the Battleborns for years. There's no more bitter enemy than an old friend. Right, so tell me about the Grey Maids. Oh, we've got an old saying. Grey Manes have lived in Whiterun since the first snows fell in Skyrim. Well, maybe that's not entirely true, but our clan's got a long and proud history in this old. We respect the old ways, the Nord ways, and the Grey Mane has worked the Skyforge since before the time of my grandfather's father. Well... That's not necessarily all that long ago. Ah, uh, so your clans used to be friends. That's even the belt bonds, like. Aye, we used to be fast friends. Though it was long ago. We were two of the city's oldest and most respected clans, and we could trace our histories all the way back to Isgrimor's companions. But then Ulfred got rich. And decided he and his kin were too good for us simple, backwards Nord folk. When the troubles began, he took the Empire side. We haven't spoken much since then. Uh -huh. Alright, I'm not going to ask him why he joined the Companions, that's fairly obvious. He's like, got a family history of it. Oh yes, we were in these Grimoire's original Companions when the Nords first turned up in Skyrim. And now they sort of claim it as their own homeland, despite the fact that they originated elsewhere. 
Oh, wait, wait. Uh, and what about your rivals, the Battleborns? Aye, they're an old clan like ours. But they cast their lot with the Empire when the uprising began. I may Old do the same, you know. made his money from farming and got himself some new friends among the Empire's nobles. Now he's in the Emperor's pocket like the rest of them, with no regard for honor and tradition. I was done talking anyway. So, I think we'll leave it a while before we pick up our next companion's quest job because we've got other quests to do on other quest lines and I'd like to get my house that's right I nearly forgot the house that, that chap there doing all that preaching he's there every day Shouting his head off about whatever it is that he's shouting about. Mainly about the traditional way of the Nords and worship of Talos and all that. Right, where is he? Where's the where's the guy that I buy the house off? There are the kids. Ah, oh, there he is, he's at the end of the Hello. One of the new servants? Remember that I like my meat rare. <laughs> Father says I'm too young to train with the sword, so I practice with my fists. Okay. This is the fella. Yes, I've an H -E, thought so. I serve Jarl Balgrum as steward. I'd like to purchase a house in the city. See, that costs five thousand gold. Do I have five thousand gold? There's a house available right now. I'll take Wonderful. it. Here's the key to your new home. Boom. That was expensive. Right. And then you can decorate it and all that, but I really don't think I've got enough Do money for any of that right reach? now. I mean, I want to put some stuff in there. I'm the commander of the guard here in White Run. Oh, you know. I thought that was Irileth did that. Commander Caius. He's an Imperial. What do you need, my friend? How is he the commander of a the guard? I thought that was Emilach, I really did. Well, uh I can talk to Lydia. Oh, she's gone through the door by herself. She's probably going to my house. Now that I've bought it. And she is my house call and all that. Okay, let's go to Bree's home. I'll show you my house. Where is it? Ballad Mare, Hemskis House, God Borax, the Ulvaska, Grey Mains House. There it is, Bree's home. So quite close to the main gate. Check the Jarl's backside. That's usually where he stuffs himself these days. I ain't done nothing. I'm not hustling you. I work with my mother to sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most days, and hard work. I spend time at the market stall so I can learn the merchant's trade. Okay. Home sweet breeze home. So fire pit without a fire in it, obviously. Um, and a table which I can sit up. Mm -hmm. uh, here I am sitting at the table. Let's get up from there. 
look so stupid walking around in this for swan outfit with the antlers. <laughs> right, and if we go up the stairs, here's the attic. That's my bed. Not much. And there is a chest. And if I put stuff in that chest, it's safe. Some stuff in there, shall we? What have I got to put in there? I know what I want to put in there. These dragon scales. No, I don't want to. There we go. Dragon scales stored. Oh, store that iron ingot. Oh, I can't, I can't get rid of that, it's a quest item. Right, okay. Uh, what about this one? Nope. So, Alright, so the places where I went with those claws, there, there are going to be quests where I'm going to have to go back to them, it would seem. That's fine, that's fine. So, uh, while I'm here, I might as well have a little sleep in the bed. Just a little one. And then go to the shops and sell some of the stuff that I can sell. So it's 2 p.m. Have a nap till 3. There we go. Should get a well rusted uh, bonus. Don't remember it saying that. Just check that. Uh, active effects. Maybe it doesn't show up here. I don't know. I thought, thought I had a, an hour's sleep. Let me just check that. Yeah, it's it's three. Like some minutes past now because time travels faster in game than it does in real life. Obviously. Um, hmm. Right. Uh, let's go to the general store. I think this here's the general oh, store. You're the new member of the companion. Got something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Right, so... Everything's for sale, my friend. Everything. If I had a sister, I'd sell her in a second. Uh... Take a look. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm not gonna buy. I'm gonna sell, sell, sell. So, what we got here? I probably don't have much on me that I'm actually selling because most of that stuff is actually still being carried by Fendal. Um, hmm. I think I'll sell. I'm not going to be using these amulets, I don't think, because I can make more interesting amulets. So, uh, sell the amulet of Kinnereth. Um, Sell the amulet of Talos, I always forget to shout anyway. Uh, sell the amulet of Julianos. Sell the amulet of Arke. Uh, let's keep the amulet of Mara for now. Um, okay, sell these gold necklaces. Uh -huh. Sell the gold diamond necklace. Sell that gold ring. Sell that gold ring of blocking. Um, sell that gold ruby necklace. Oh, oh wait, <laughs> no, he's he's run out of gold. All right, well that's enough for today. Then. <laughs> Do come back. Uh, I'll come back when you've got some more money to give me for my wares. So how am I doing for cash actually? So I've got 2,361 gold left, which is quite surprising really after I spent five grand on my house. You know what's Gyron these days? Everyone is obsessed with death. 
Everyone's obsessed with death? Right, uh... Journal, 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 journal. So yeah, we have a night to remember to finish off. Find the wedding ring in Witch Mist Grove. I think we want to pick up Feindal before we set off to do that. So, let's see. Well, what? Oops, didn't mean to do that. Move it. Right there we go. Now, ah, uh, there's Witch Mist Grove. Not too bad. So. Did, oh yeah, Iverstead, that was it. I found him in Iverstead. Didn't I? Or did I? Did I actually find him? I found him in Riverwood. We'll go to Riverwood by fast travel. And then we'll fast travel to... Hmm. We'll fast travel to Darkshade, I think. And then work across from Darkshade to which miss grove that'll probably work maybe we can have a go clearing dark shade as well while we're at it okay so let's see if we can find fandal Actually, sell some of the stuff in here as well. This trader's got some money. Hey, uh. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. The Riverwood trader is back to the way it used to be. Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Doesn't have a lot of gold, but he's got enough to be getting on with. Right. Sell that. My speech increases from doing this selling, you see. Now I've got plenty of these silver garlic rings. Let's sell all of them. Okay, uh, plenty of silver rings. Sell the silver. A sapphire necklace. Keep hold of that. Ah, I should wear that any time I'm trying to improve weapons and armour. Oh well. Um, what else have we got? Yeah, I'll sell that gold ring. Increases your magic by two points. Got a lot of garnets here. Oh no, he's only got like 30 gold left. Uh, no, nope, can't even sell him an amethyst. Right, well, that'll do for that. Okay, good. Right. Now. That's uh, our Lord Secret's house. Papa says I'm too friendly with strangers. But you seem alright. Hey. My father is Alvor, the blacksmith. I'm his assistant. I mean apprentice. Hello. Hey, you want to play a game? Uh, sure. What game do you want to play? Really? All right, you pick. Tag or hide and seek? Uh, let's play hide and seek. I know all the good spots. You don't stand a chance. You stand right there and count to ten. No peeking. Ready? Yep. Okay, go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Coming ready or not? See, I'm already looking for Fane Dark. I'm getting two birds with one stone doing this. 
Okay, can anyone see a little girl hiding anywhere? See a little girl hiding anywhere? Wait, is that him? Yo, yo, yo! Divine smile on you, friend. What you done with all the kit I gave you? Good to see a familiar face so far from home. Lead the way. Still here. What do you want me to carry? I need to check that you've still got all this stuff that I gave you. Okay, you've still got it all. Good, good. So he's gone back to wearing his normal clothes. Uh, but it's fine. But I'm gonna take some things from you. That salmon steak, for example. We'll sort the other stuff out when we. Ah, wait! <laughs> Fuck you! You found me! Ten, nine, eight, six, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hey! I'm coming! Did you find me? Did you find someone? Huh? Okay, it's time to stop playing now. My father is Alvin, the blacksmith. I'm his assistant. I mean apprentice. You're new around here, so I'll go easy on you. But don't get on my bad side. Get me mad, and I'll prank you. And not a little, a lot. <laughs> So let's fast travel to Should we go to Darkshade or Lost Knife Hideout? Well there was something to do at Fort Ammo perhaps. No there wasn't. I picked that up off one of those tactical maps or strategic maps rather. Um yeah, let's let's travel from Lost Knife Hideout. Mushrooms aren't ready yet. Come on, grab that. Aww. There are a lot of dragonflies here. I want to catch some. Yes, got one. Fendel's back in his kit. Rumbling noise. It's definitely a rumbling noise. Oh, I discovered Fort Amel. Yeah, it's definitely a rumbling. Oh, what's going on there? Ah, yeah, this is the uh, area that's like a volcanic kind of a thing going on. Dragon's tomb? Yeah, there are. See the steam coming out of the ground. But this is all lovely and warm, this water. Oh dear. Oh, I thought she was drowned and dead. She's just having a soak in the warm volcanic water. Need something? No, no, no. Um, ooh, nice sword, but, yeah, you guys are just having a nice camp out in the hot springs. Creek cluster. Yeah. 
pine forests and hot springs. Elder Gleam Sanctuary. Hmm. Be interesting to see what's going on in there, but uh, I said I was going to be a bit more focused on the quest, so we'll leave it be. There is a dragon. We are going to have to engage this dragon, I believe. That is part of what we are going to be doing. We need to take out dragons. Here it comes. Oh, Take this and hold on to it. I'll be back for it later. I'll pay you good. Don't lose it. Tipped. Ah. Um. Don't have time to talk to you, man. We're dying under a dragon attack. That was a really bad time for that kind of scripted event. Right. Um. Have to switch to healing. Okay. Right. Uh, Elven bow. Okay. Like some kind of spade tail, that dragon. Oh! Oh, dear me. Blood dragon. Right, it's breathing fire on me. I need to take a potion of fire resistance. Resist fire. And I want to poison my bow. Ah, uh, poison of lingering damage health. Yeah, alright. Where is it? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no 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 I uh, thought that was gonna happen. I should have fast saved. Should have quick saved. Yeah, you're gonna have to do all that again. Right. Map. Lost knife hideout. First of all to lost knife hideout. Catch a dragonfly. Ooh! Swordfish eggs. Ammo. Rumble, rumble, rumble. And get to the volcanic area. Cut with this. Oh, I didn't quite catch that. Grab some dragon's tongue, grab some creep cluster, enjoy the hot springs. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a fate stone over this way, let's check that out. Dragon. Yep, 
There it is. charge left but I can stop the come back to charge it at any point so um, I think we'll poison it okay here it comes and quick save thing here it goes yes oh ow, it's got frost damage this time that's so interesting. Last time it was fire damage. Okay, I need a potion of uh, regenerate health. Wouldn't hurt. <laughs> Is that the only regenerate health potion I've got? Oh well. I really was too powerful for potion of regenerate health. That's all right. That means that the bad effect that was part of that potion won't affect me, which I knew it wouldn't. Um, I'll take the potion of true shot. Have I got resist frost? Yes I have. Resist frost. Uh, potion of minus stamina. Um, let's put some more poison on this. See if we can use the frostbite venom on it. Oof. Oofed. I don't know if I'm going to survive this. Why you need damage over time on a dragon because I keep flying off and it's very hard to actually hit one while it's flying. Uh, we need some better arrows as well. So currently we're using Felma arrows, they do 8 damage. Switch back to the Ancient Lord arrows. Yes. so close maybe I can just go melee on it what do you think Let's give it a go Yeah. 
These are my handmade health potions from the last time I did a. Um, let's do some tomato shaped bread. Oh, goodness me. Item has insufficient charge. Right. So, this needs charging up again. Oh, it's dead, it's dead. It's dead, it's dead, it's dead. Hurrah! That's what I needed. Dragon power. What? Oh! I'm getting attacked again. That was a spriggan. That was our first spriggan. Decided to sneak up behind us while we were fighting a dragon. Let's take that tap root. Okay, meanwhile, search the dragon. We've got dragon bones, dragon scales, all super heavy, gold. Some of the arrows I used, some of the arrows somebody else used. Ah, <sighs> right. Pardon me. Now, oh what? Oh no! There's more hostiles around. I may have to drink a potion of strength or something. I don't want to have to do that. I needed to save that really. If only I could get Feindel to come back here. I don't know, can I? Can, will he come back? He's gone off looking for enemies. Feindel! Come back to me. Ah, oh, that's better. I'm right behind you. Right, I need to trade some things with you. Dragon bones. Wait, why can't I give him them? Showing that I can't give them to him. The item is too heavy to carry. See, this is the thing, I need to get more of the stuff off of him. I've, even after I sold all that stuff in the shop because I was selling stuff that was lightweight and uh, like um, gems and, and uh, jewellery rather than the stuff that was heavy. I didn't really free myself up that much. Well, that's really rather annoying. Let's see what I can manage to give him then. Um, give him the dragon scales, they're still quite heavy. That was it. Can't take another one. Yeah, he's pretty much at his limit. Right, Let's see what he's got. Gonna have to drop some of the stuff he is carrying, basically. Oh, he's not wearing the White Run Guard's helmet anymore. So we'll take that off of him. Oh, that's too light, doesn't really make a difference. Banded Iron Armor. That's super heavy. Let's take that off of him. And then me. Banded Iron Armor. Uh, I want to drop it. Oh, well, I have to come out of this first. You lead, I'll follow. And we get bandit iron armor. Drop. Okay. 
Now we're both a little lighter. Wait, no, I'm not lighter yet. I've got to hand some stuff off to him. What do you want me to carry? Going then. Yes, let's. Now I've got a dragon cell. Oh, so I can activate one of these other shouts. So let's become ethereal. There's one of the other sections of Whirlwind Sprint. And there's slow towing. That one might be kind of handy. There's Elemental Fury. Which speeds you up. So you slow time or speed me up. Hmm. Uh, let's try locking slow time. I'm trying to remember which ones I used to use. Yep, spend that dragon cell. Oh yeah. Put a favourite on that. Otherwise I'm not likely to use it, am I? Okay. And Jazz Bay grapes growing in the wild. I clearly like to grow in Volcanic Springs. Ooh, yeah. Just a... Uh Dragon's tongue. Let's get another dragon's tongue. Get it while you're here. So it doesn't grow anywhere else. Okay. And I think we're almost there. Which missed Grove? Let's see. Oh, great. So, um, this is my fiance. Darling, I've been waiting for you to return to consummate our love. Um, actually, I was hoping to get the ring back. What? You want it for that hussy Esmeralda with the dark feathers, don't you? I won't let her have you. Oh, she's gone hostile. That wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Usually hug ravens have really nasty spells. Okay. Got the wedding ring back, but we're still not much closer to figuring out what the heck the story with the staff is, or what Sam and I got up to when we went on our drunken bender. Ooh, dwarf embraces and major smithing. Oof. See what we've got in here. <sighs> She's been shedding feathers. That's a good thing because they're an alchemical ingredient, you know. Don't know, well, don't know what these net bugs have got in them. They look like something, but search barrel. 
some lavender. She doesn't grow in these parts. Ahoy! Read response to Biro's speech. This is going to increase my destruction, I think. Yes, it did. Okay. Because it has the destruction symbol on the cover of the book, you see.